In America, we're hearing a lot of rumors about what's happening in Nigeria. Can you help to make it clear what's actually going on? Well, this is it's not a rumor. It's actually uh, things that are happening every day in Nigeria, killings by different state actors. So these are reality, and these are cited by different uh, news media of these killings, either by Boko Haram or by Fulani militants and other actors. What's the government doing about it, the Nigerian government? Well, uh, Nigerian government is doing nothing because uh, the killing is increasing per day. What can Americans do to help, if anything? Well, uh, like, we can start from the angle of uh, human rights violations that is taking place in Nigeria and killings, terrorist act happening in Nigeria, and then uh, U.S. is committed to fighting terrorism, so U.S. has responsibility to fight terrorism in Nigeria. What's specifically happening in Kaduna State? Oh, Kaduna State is another theater uh, uh, of uh, slaughtering that is taking place because uh, Governor Nasi Rufai, over time, has told us he has paid even the, uh, the Fulani bandits killing people, but the killing has not stopped. And even in Kaduna alone this month, we have over 100 deaths. So, and uh, we have uh, several other issues like uh, uh, homelessness of uh, those who have been affected, people who are unable to go back to their villages and farms. So we have a humanitarian crisis as a result of this. Can the Trump administration do anything to make a difference? Sure. It's about uh, human uh, dignity when human lives are being violated and also when uh, a governor of a state is taking side and claiming that uh, uh, the killings are as a result of reprisal attack and even the president mentioned that last week that is president buhari mentioned that so they need to be held accountable but yes. how can the trump administration hold them accountable yeah he will, he can hold them accountable like what he did in the, in the middle east by ending uh, uh, isis so now he can also extend such a, uh, action he took in the Middle East to Nigeria. What specifically can the Trump administration do to help in Nigeria? Yeah, one thing that is important and that is urgent is by sending presidential special envoy to Nigeria and that will resolve these issues like what happened uh, in Sudan. And we, are, we have even different envoys to different uh, uh, locations in the world. So Nigeria needs one where this envoy will have some requisite authority of U.S. government to oversee uh, the region that is afflicted by this uh, conflict in Nigeria and the Lake Chad region. So by this, uh, we'll be able to know what exactly or who exactly is funding who because the U.S. will be able to deploy uh, her intel and also work with some allies in Nigeria and in West African region by helping us to stop this because once an envoy is there, we'll know that a lot of people will be held accountable. And with that, this conflict, this terrorism happening in this region can stop within a few days. Is this something that needs to happen quickly or does the administration It is now, time? it's just uh, the, this appeal for an envoy has been ongoing, but we, it's needed more than ever now, today. We need such an envoy today.